Hey, what's going on, boys? Uh, taking a quick break from Vilheim. Uh, started a cyberpunk playthrough, and I got to the end of the main story, but I kind of wanted to restart one uh, playing with you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and do hard. And then I kind of played a more ranged guy before, so I'm actually going to do a kind of ninja assassin, focus on weapons. And I'm going to do corpo. Uh, these are the different type of backgrounds you can have. I did Nomad in my first playthrough. Uh, roaming the Badlands, looting scrapyards, raiding fuel depots, life on the road wasn't easy, but growing up in a Nomad clan has its perks. Honesty, integrity, and a love of freedom, qualities that few in Night City possess and no amount of money can buy. So I kind of went with that one. I'm going to do Corpo though, that one seems kind of cool. Few leave the corporate world with their lives, fewer leave it with their souls intact. You've been there. You've bent the rules, exploited secrets, and weaponized information. There's no such thing as a fair game, only winners and losers. So that one sounds super cool with a ninja assassin playthrough. Uh, just kind of go through this. <laughs> Try to make my guy look like Leonidas, the character from uh, 300. With a slight modern Cybertunk 2077 feel to it. Okay, so we got a pretty basic uh, Leonidas character going now. It's got the beard and the hair. It's got that strong jawline, so we're good. Uh, for the ninja build, you want to focus uh, body uh, cool for the killer instinct or blood fuel perk. And then finally... Uh, you can either choose reflexes or intelligence, but the big one is body for damage, uh, cool for your multiplier, and then we'll go one in reflex. I'm actually going to shift one into intelligence. Uh, yeah. Through, while I've already played through the main story, is still going to be a bunch like quite a bit different just because I have a different background. Uh, some will be the same for sure, but just based on what I choose, like that's a huge part of this game. Your choices have effects. Um, so looking at like 30 to 45 minute playthroughs, and I'll try to edit like the driving and kind of shorter stuff. Already, this is a completely different. Uh, experience that I had in the first one.
You start very differently as a nomad. This is so cool. This is like completely different than my first playthrough already. That's what I love about this game. Like more than any other game besides maybe like Detroit. Um, that AI game. Like choices make such a huge difference. Don't worry about me. I'll manage on my own. Not my first time. this voting issue before we lose our bases in the sea of clouds they're about to begin what's the situation hmm. yeah so in case you've never played this game mm -hmm. if you join as the nomad uh, you start like off in the desert somewhere completely different from this you know what to so this is actually my first time experiencing what we're seeing now too that seemed like a corporate takeover on a pretty big scale it's pretty cool. Director Evans. I watched the vote. What the hell was that? A deep clean after the shit Frankfurt dumped on. As we agreed, I got rid of the problem. I told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? We would have lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. We're not done talking about this. I hate that bitch. I always have. This isn't the first time Abernathy set you up. No, not the first. Smeared me in front of Japanese execs, so she'd be the one promoting. So my first time playing through, I was kind of like a nicer, trying to be like a good, honest guy. Uh, I think this time I'm going to be more of a rogue, uh, aggressive type. So all my options for dialogue and choices I make are going to be more aggressive and kind of self-focused, just to give it a different feel. Effective. What would you do? position you have to defend yourself remind Abernathy you're not her doormat you're right smack her once but hard she'll respect you Seems just you once that, that's fair just just one
Take this. Ooh. Got a data shard. Collected over the past weeks. Biometrics, trauma team card, names of her closest associates. Driver, chief of security, lover, lover's husband. Everything. Use it and make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said it. I need to defend myself. What'll happen if I refuse? Don't ask stupid questions. <laughs> this isn't a request, V. We seem to understand each other. Take this, too. Oh, hell yeah. Use this money only. Find the right people for the job. No corporate affiliation. And for the core task, use someone you know inside out. Are we clear? Yeah, I think we're clear. Good. In that case, I'll await your report. And good luck with it. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. And don't disappoint me. Oh, this is such a cool playthrough. I have those reports you asked for. I'll forward them to your inbox. Uh, apologies for the delay. AV, you alive? I'll stick to the Viper Beam. Viper Beam. Couldn't have said it better. You in some trouble? Not yet. Right now, I just need a soul I can trust. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. So I like to always do the optional quests. I find you find out like pretty critical pieces of information, or you get bonus experience, or anything it's really. Possible one of our assets was exposed. Always good to just, you know, get a little cognitive boost. Vaccination with the stars. Here we go. After assessing data collect collected from contacts reporting Utah, Nevada, Arizona, Montana, we did not confirm any active new saw efforts against our SACA assets or operations. Okay, cool. Let's head to the garage, see what kind of car we're dealing with. Destination Lizzie's Bar. This is fancy. Playing the Nomad, it's a lot less high class than this. That was that much of an accident there, boys. <laughs> kind of looked at it live. Ooh, hell yeah. Gotta get ourselves a katana as soon as we can. That'll start off the ninja character pretty well. Ooh, our life coach. That's new. Yes? We weren't scheduled to connect till the end of the week. 
quantified Satori received notification of a somewhat troubling biometric reading. I felt I should call. Is everything in order? I'm dealing with the temporary nuisance. Nothing you should worry about. Just think back to our last session. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day, they'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. <laughs> sure, okay. See you later. This Corpo uh, playthrough is kind of, <laughs> yeah, like I said, it's really different than the Nomad. You're kind of like a rich douchebag. <laughs> the Nomad, you're a lot more like scrappy, like building yourself up from nothing, which is cool. But it's a nice change of pace. Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Up procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Psychosu, this look like a landing pad to you. Could have fucking crushed us. Bro, okay, no, no, hey, we, we ain't looking for no beef with you. That was probably a little bit of a overreaction, but that's kind of how my play play style is gonna be this time. Keep an eye on the AV for me, will you? I don't get paid to do that. I wasn't asking. I'm not a scratch on it when I get back. Welcome to Lizzie's. Tell me what's got your shorts in a knife. It's good to see you too, Jack. How you been? I got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and Maelstrom. Eddie's there for the taking. As long as you don't get flatlined. Yeah, you know how it is. I can't complain, but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. Let me hear about this problem of yours. Data shard. Take it. Come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie, maybe two. A runner with a gold plated brain. And a driver with wheels from hell. Not to mention a solo. Hmm. Piece I'm missing. Know what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? Delicate situation. That's why I need somebody I can trust. This ain't no delicate situation. So in case you guys have never played this guy, this is like your best friend in the game, uh, Jackie. He's in both playthroughs that I've played so far. Um, in the other one, you meet him a little bit differently, but soon to be the same kind of relationship. Tequila with grenadine and lime. Nothing better for drowning nerves. To this. Was that a toast? What the hell does that even mean? You raise a glass to your mama, your hermana, to the mamacita you meet at the bar, but this doesn't say a damn thing. To this. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. You know what it is? Been saying it all along. Soldier, soldier, those Arisaka fuckers. Today, 
They got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. In case you didn't know, the slang for like kill or take someone out is zero. So whenever you hear that, that's what they're referring to. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty picky about who I let touch my balls. <laughs> yeah, me too, Jackie. Oh, they definitely do not make the cut. Maybe someday, but for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always. Re hey, you lost? Got a problem? B, is that right? Did Jenkins send you? Don't believe I know you. You don't, but we know you very well. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. No, don't believe I will. That's between me and Jenkins. Gah, fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. The data, now. I don't have a choice. This is my only option right now. Information's on the shore. Smart choice. <sighs> we done. With the formalities, yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our feet for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up. You're coming with us. Come on, move Bye it. Us, I think you fellows might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm not sure this body is your style, let alone a healthy option. Get a cloud. Is that a threat? Well, you start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? We have what we came for. We can do for now. Hell yeah, Jackie had her back. I just noticed Jackie's haircut. <laughs> Still got that wad for the hit job, don't you? Probably some fat ass chunk That's of so weird. Just right for a new start. That's right, fool. Buckle up. Hey, you hearing all right? Look so hot. B, B. Hey, Edmano. Your new life. It starts now. in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask you... So this is actually like a really similar cutscene to the one from the other playthrough. Yeah, 
Yeah, so I guess no matter what backstory you pick, you end up leaving whatever you start in and kind of joining Jackie. Because, yeah, this cutscene's basically identical. Chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? I'm going to skip the tutorial uh, just because I already did it in my first playthrough, so there's no real. No real point on me doing it again, but if you guys are playing for the first time, highly recommend it. You learn a lot. This way. Looks like our only choice is a pistol or bare hands for now, so we'll just rock the pistol until we get ourselves a katana blade. Yeah, we don't have a knife or anything so until we get a bladed weapon we'll do that targets Sandra Dorset targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back suspected abduction target could have possibly flatlined already not sure you're in time we're in time bug we sure you're on phones but that don't make you any less part of this squad squad charming Bug, you could at least try to be nice. You want nice, supportive? Call a damn helpline. Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corporal Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep a looking. Try to keep things quiet for as long as we can.
So this is the breach protocol, it'll lower all uh, other hacks you do, um, lower the cost, the RAM cost of them. We'll go into more about what hacking and all that stuff is later once we kind of increase our skill. Don't see any movement on the sensors. Looks like you got them. Clear to go. Shit, where the hell's our target? Look around, gotta be there somewhere. Got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, Jack into our Vitamon. Need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. This does not look good. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked Vitamon, firmware we could fig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T Bug. You ain't seeing this. Reminds me of Minority Report a lot. <laughs> uh, ice tub and all that stuff. It's got much as hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find the shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's feeding the Biomon. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the Biomon. Anything change? Reading, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jackie, air hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Engage, Vato! I think... Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, cabrón. Get her outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace. Back now. Tink, 
to control. Patient NC570442 secured. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Vernogen. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Yeah. This is my it's a good little thing. introduction I mission. I your wheels. Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's oh, they gonna look for me? Only if you hang a jack, but don't get used to it. You saved my ass, B. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. The job's done. <clears throat> B, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. Of course she's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you are to make it past the corridor, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. Stop digging Night City. City like any other, just bigger. Nah, mano, not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Whalen, Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say, Jackie? They're locking down Watson, remember? Oh, shit. Right. Is it just me? Oh, I fucking knew it. Big ass. Taking us. Hello. I don't like it. No more tiny bit. Fucking drive, Jackie. Man, got a bullet holes in my car now. It's okay. Damn. Wait. Let's just focus on getting home. This is gonna be sketchy rolling up to this police checkpoint with bullet holes in the car. down to further notice. Necessary security measures. Officer, ma'am. Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes you so special? A uh, heart of gold. 
Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. I'm waiting. <sighs> That's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Let them through. But they do laugh. Nice. Okay. Talked her way through that one. Got pretty lucky there. Hell yeah. Could have gone a couple ways. <laughs> Those guys just got hand. fucked. Dogs out there, though. Holy shit. Okay, well, that was a good little intro. Um, the further we get in this game, the kind of more exciting we'll get. This is still the intro tutorial type type part of the game. But, yeah, uh, as soon as we get kind of through this past intro part, um, it gets pretty fast and it's, it'll be fun. Once we get our first katana, it will be uh, pretty awesome. We'll start to actually be able to develop our player as a ninja. Um, so we'll focus on katana, maybe sniper rifles, kind of that long range, short range assassin. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to end the video here just because we're pushing 30 minutes. I don't want it to be too long. Uh, I think we actually have a katana waiting in here. Yep, black unicorn. Hell yeah. We'll get the blazer going. Just go with that uh, office look. So let's go ahead and put all that stuff on. And we'll equip our katana. Hell yeah. I like the business assassin look. Kind of slightly John Wicky. Uh, we'll get a little bit more refined in the coming videos, but awesome. Uh, yeah, and we got our first attribute point. So these are attributes. And then if you click in, these are all perks. Um, so we got one attribute point. We're going to put that in body for right now. Uh, to do that, you just hold F over the thing. And then we want to start boosting our uh, katana bonuses as quick as we can.
So I'm gonna go with yeah, we'll go increase attack speed with blades by 10% for our first perk. Um, so yeah, we'll go body reflexes and probably cool for cool. The big thing is this cold blood. It just adds like stack perks and a bunch of other stuff that's super helpful for melee. But yeah, that's going to be the video today, gents. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. It's going to get quicker, I promise. And yeah, hope you guys have a good night. And we will check back in with you guys tomorrow, probably. Uh, this is Leonidas signing off. Uh, yeah, get ready for a long, cool playthrough of uh, Cyberpunk 2077.